Hello everyone. Waiting for Jason to get Costco gas really quick. Just wanted to give you a little a bit of an update. Um, I crashed on Mother's Day. <laughs> totally was sick the entire day. don't really know what was wrong other than a headache that like just shut down like my whole body I don't know how to explain it it was like part dizzy part nauseous part like exhausted like I slept all day long except the headache hurt enough that I couldn't sleep very well thank you anyway it was awful and I like I couldn't open my eyes so you think oh I'm just tired lay in bed watch a show and just rest and you know take advantage of the downtime but like my head hurt so bad that I couldn't like do anything I remember staying in one position for hours because I just I was worried if I moved I would get nauseous I never did but anyway it was very strange and I just felt bad that I don't know Jason made me breakfast in bed and he did such a good job and I didn't even have the energy to truly like thank him I mean, he knows that I'm, I'm I was thankful for it but in the moment I just like okay thanks I'm gonna go to bed <laughs> Um, I tried to get up and I actually put makeup on. I had um, all my church calls to get on for, but I just, I did one for like 20 minutes because a friend had asked me to kind of give some little thoughts as part of her lesson. And I just, as soon as I did that, I turned off my screen and I walked away from it and I told Jason to come back and turn it off when the lesson was over. I didn't want her to think that I was like ditching out on her lesson. So I wanted it to stay on, but I went back to bed and that was probably at like, I don't even know what time in the morning it was. I also watched my niece give a talk at her church. She's going on her to serve a mission for our church in Tahiti. <laughs> so I listened to her and then did this little lesson for 20 minutes and I went to bed. This guy like held down the fort their whole day. I gotta turn off the music when it turns on, hang on. And the kids did well, they had- Everybody just lounged around, it was a pretty- You were tired too, day. weren't you? I was tired. I took some naps because there's nothing else to do. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, so it was kind of a ho-hum kind of day, except that my sister had her baby, and it's like, none of us are going to be able to top Mother's Day now. Like, she has a baby on Mother's Day. It's like my mom's dream come true. I could only, like, look at the pictures. I could really not even, like, respond to any of the text messages that were going back and forth. That's making me really dizzy. Can you just pick a spot that's like I'm easier a spot. to get in? These are where the spots are at. I can't make like it any complete, easier. Oh, made me, di made me dizzy. Anyway, I couldn't respond to any of the text messages about um, her having a baby. I could just look at the pictures and then show them, show the pictures to the kids. So I just barely got to respond to all those messages. And then my sister, my twin sister, who is a teacher, had a lockdown at her school today because they had a suspicious bag left behind somewhere. I don't know the details. So they went into lockdown and they're, we're still trying to wait and find out. She says she's fine, everything is cleared and the lockdown has been lifted, but we're kind of waiting to see what actually happened or if she knows what happened. And I just joked with her, I'm like, dude, you have a risky <laughs> business being a teacher, like fires you know, lockdowns, you should find a different career that's safer. <laughs> and that's maybe joking about it, but it's true, like, anyway. Well, it's because our school caught fire like a year ago. Well. For those that don't know. Two years ago. Why teaching relates to fires. Yeah, well then her, her house burnt down, not burnt down, but caught on fire a year after her school caught on fire. So, <laughs> anyway. So I've been like trying to catch up with my family. I'm like, sorry, I didn't get to back to any of you yesterday. I just couldn't. I couldn't even look look at my phone. No, you weren't doing good. I wasn't doing good. Better today. Back at the normal Costco. I don't know why we're on a two times a week rotation. I'm not sure what we're missing. I don't know what we're doing things. wrong. Anyway, back at Costco. I'm not even gonna show you what we're gonna get because it's the same old and it's the staples. But I don't know. Yeah. And then Kaylee gets her second vaccine shot today with her friend. We're taking them this afternoon. So we'll show that. We might even make that a separate video, right? Yeah, I want to see what her reaction to it is. I don't know what, like we haven't really heard what teenage reactions are to the second dose. So I'm going to probably do that in a separate video just to keep it like centralized on one topic. We'll see how the day goes. It's so beautiful today. This is what spring in the Northwest really looks like. I mean, it's just blue skies 
a little bit of a breeze and it feels really good out there. So we'll see if it lasts. I want to go for a run. Are you going to go for a run later? Yeah, I think I want to do that. Yeah, I need to, yep, because next week I'm going to do that hike again. Oh, um, you're going to try for it again? Yep. All right. All right. Costco and then we'll see how our day goes. All right. I'm going to follow up with Jason here. I've been working on the computer. He's been working out here with your dad, right? Yeah, Is he gone? We, we trimmed down the tree. Had to figure this out a little bit. I don't know. How little first time accident I've ever done <gasps> before. Yeah. Just what happened? You just don't want the cord to get caught in the hedge trimmer. Oh, yeah, you think? <laughs> I was moving it and I thought, oh no, I don't want to get it. And I tried to move it and it got caught. So, splice it here. He's going to go get electrical tape. I, I don't have electrical tape. We're going to strap it and then good as new. Voila. Yeah, without like burning down the house. No, it's just, oh crap. And then you Damn. stop and you unplug it. I didn't know that happened. I oh, know. It's, it's just. Okay. It's an extension cord. I've All never right. done that before, but you know. You live and learn? It happens in people's lives. <laughs> okay. Um, but you got it cleaned up here. Did you put the mulch down out front or out back? No. I see it right there. I know, I just brought it around. <laughs> There's another bag. I know. I just brought this one around. I didn't okay. bring both back. Okay. All right. So is your dad coming back? I went to Target to get electrical tape. Okay. I thought I had some, but I don't. I'm gonna probably because have to... I've never done this with cords before, so I don't. Okay. You're usually pretty cautious. It was an accident. I understand that it was an accident. It All right. Um, yeah. So we'll fix that, and then. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna take Kaylee for her vaccine. Then you'll stay here. I guess so. I wasn't gonna go, but I'm kind of sweaty. I think I'm just gonna change and go for a run. Okay. Don't do anything fun without me. Really, driving two cities over to get a vaccine is a whole lot of fun. Maybe we'll have to get a frosted smoothie See, without you I'm then. Saying. That's what I'm saying. Don't do anything fun without me. All right. He's just worried. I'm gonna go get a frosted lemonade from or from uh, what is it called? Chick Fil A. Yeah. I have all the kids here now. Abby just got home from school. I forgot she was going to school again this morning. She sends me a text message. I need my COVID, what do they call it? I, yeah, so I have to like answer questions on whether she's been exposed to any COVID contacts. Oh, that light's like completely dead now. Okay. Even the kitchen one. Um, the kitchen? Wait. Um, okay, that's the problem. Hey, babe, did you turn off power to the other half of this house? Because it's not working. So, was this plugged into the house? So, is the breaker tripped? Because the lights don't work in here. Down lights kitchen. Okay, does it work now? Yep. Okay, do the other lights work? Yep. Dad tripped the breaker because um, he cut the cord out there. Okay. Oh. Are you done with homework? Mm -hmm. Yes? Mm -hmm. Nothing on your checklist? Nope. I'll ask the check. Okay. Kaylee, are we taking you soon? Yeah. We're there getting flu. Okay, but I was hoping to go soon because we got to get back. So hurry. Okay. We are on our way, right, Kaylee? Where are you? Right there. Second dose. I just want to see what your reaction is tomorrow. Okay. Yes, he's going to, but... He can be in the video. Okay, well, as long as he's comfortable with it, you're not, so... <laughs> but I just need to get your reaction tomorrow, mainly, mm. on how it affects teenagers. Because a lot of people are curious. Mm. Alright, so we just got Katie and her friend Jacob vaccinated. Stay tuned till tomorrow and you can watch that video and it'll have her reaction to the vaccine as well. And they're locked out. And I also have good news for Abby when we get home. So I'm gonna tell her that on camera. They don't know I've unlocked it. <laughs> I wonder if they're gonna try. It's been unlocked, you guys. Could have gotten in. I, um, all right, all right. Okay, so Abby, I have good news for you. Huh? I have good news for you. What? You are scheduled for your vaccine on Saturday. Is that like 
Saturday? Yeah, drive through with Allegro. Oh, where? Um, over in Bellevue somewhere. Oh, okay. Okay? And this little squirt, Abby did French braids in your hair? Yes. I love the little oh, wavy hair, <laughs> right? Okay, um, go get cleaned up and I will figure out dinner, okay? Dinner. So, oh, very exciting news that Abby can get her vaccine in like five days. That's so cool. I'm gonna try and figure out dinner here. Got some, what are these called? Chicken patties, chicken breast tenderloins. I actually really like these. And then we can get some veggies and then I'll just make some potatoes or something. What they call it? Tenderloin chicken breast. I don't know. Anyway. I've got time to You had time to work out? Did you go on a run? I went on a run. I'll go do some weights later. But Did you put mulch in the backyard? I put all the mulch there is out there, yeah. Okay. Kaylee pulled in, so I wasn't on that side to see it. She drove us home from the park. It's fine. If you don't appreciate my work, it's okay. I can live with it. He's such a schmuck. <laughs> you don't appreciate the fact that I put all the other mulch. Shush. I did 15 bags of mulch. You did one. You did one and a half. You gotta make sure I'm on camera so you don't just do this to me. Uh, stop. And I did. I came home and I said it was really good. I'm just giving you crap. I know you're so giving me crap. Like my, this is what my life is like. Day in and day out. Is Have you given me crap? I like Every day. <laughs> okay, whatever. All right, so we've got dinner in the oven. I've got potatoes and little chicken tenders. And then I've got peas up there in the microwave. And now Jason and I get to rush and go to our first parent. Katie, are you getting ready for that call? Okay, okay, so we're doing our first parent student driving class. But Kaylee has to get on to, on a separate call, or a separate line, I should say. I can't do this with you guys. Okay, so I'm waiting for my computer to work. We, Kaylee has signed up for driving school, and since most of it is virtual, aside from like actual driving around, she has five of those appointments. But everything else is just an online class via Zoom, and so we have one night tonight where we have to join as parents. And just, I think it's just a general overview of what the class will entail and what our responsibilities are as a parent, which I feel like we kind of have a feel for what we're supposed to do. We have the app, she's getting hours driving and it logs the hours and she sends that with her each week she, or each day she has like, you know, a worksheet she fills out for school. So anyway, we're gonna hop online here and do this for the next hour. Fun, fun, but I'm kind of glad we're doing this like virtually <laughs> and not having to like leave and go down there. So there are some perks to doing this this year. All right, we are closing up the house for the night. Everyone but Kaylee is in bed so far. And uh, the other ones haven't started fighting? Uh, not yet, but that's because Ashley still has her iPad on. I was gonna say. <laughs> so, the fight doesn't. Fight doesn't... After the iPad. Exactly. <laughs> oh my, there are rocks right here. Here, let me shut that real quick. Oh, I got a kink in my back. So to get, Kaylee's reaction to her vaccine. I put in a little bit of her going to get the vaccine in today's video just to, because that's pretty much all we did today. But to get her reaction to the vaccine tomorrow to see if she has any symptoms from it, um, stay tuned for that video. That will come up next. I think we're gonna call it a night tonight. Jason held me off on watching Seeking Sister Wives until he got home, correct? Yeah, we're, we're gonna watch the uh, little cult leaders and <laughs> it's like our thing now he's like it is. I, I i hate these people but i can't it's like a train wreck yeah i can't stop me so much but i gotta watch it <laughs> and tonight so leave your comments below on the episode you saw last and we should maybe start a pool on whether the one lady who got divorced so they could bring the brazilian uh, brazilian in whether they last or whether they hang her out to dry so you can have a yeah. Google chat with his new Brazilian wife. <laughs> that is what we're doing tonight. Oh, Abby hides cookies. She's she's a little elf. I well I won't show her because she doesn't like to be on. But she, she's like hovering over them right now. They were my Mother's Day cookies. And you already had some. I had two. Are you Abby? I made them. That's why she makes them because she can hoard them. 
She always sets aside her own stash. Um, so sad thing tonight for dinner. It, the alarm someone, did get set. Someone Sign. mocked me. I did mock you because he set a microwave timer and I was like, let's done, let's just set the Alexa one. And then it didn't set, so I burned dinner. Whatever. It is what it is. Someone should have listened to their husband. Should have. Didn't. Don't care. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, all right. I, uh, I know, I know, I know. I, I don't know why I'm looking that. in the fridge. I'm not really that hungry. I'm looking boarding. for a snack. I'm it's looking for a snack. We have chips. Yes. Like tortilla chips. I want tortilla food. chips. The tortilla chips are in the garage. Yes, I know. I'm going to have some chips and cheese. That's what I'm going to do. Chips and cheese. So, we are going to sign off. Stay tuned for Kaylee's reaction. And... Abby will get her test or her vaccine in five days. So stay tuned for that one as well. I'm going to have her in my car when she goes to get that test. It's a drive through vaccine clinic that they're running through our pediatrician's offices. They have like a clinic that they're going to do. So we are going to go to that appointment prepped for her to pass out <laughs> because she does not do well with vaccines. But after she gets her vaccine, we are two thirds of the way from getting our entire family vaccinated, which is super good news. It is good news. Good news. Take care and we will see you guys next time. And leave your sister wife's opinions below. <laughs> if you have, it looks like we have like a studio flashlight like on us, but it's really our oh, janky no, it's like, <laughs> janky light. It's our janky kitchen uh, light. We got ghetto lights in here. We need really, to you wanna, I, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. It, yeah, it's, it's ghetto. It's ghetto. It's a good high energy efficient light bulb. Just it has no <laughs> glass bulb over it. <laughs> it, has, it has a what is that? A jar? A mason lid? jar lid. A mason holding jar it lid. on. And then the light bulb. Classy. <laughs> if you wanted a project. That's what we could have done today. I'm a little intimidated on in how to replace this. Anyways, sister wife, comment below. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Subscribe. See you next tomorrow. Bye, guys.